So, after a week off without F1, uh, and just before we get back into racing this weekend, at the Saudi Arabian Grand Prix, Jeddah Corniche, uh, we had have some major, I'd say, pretty major um, safety updates to the track itself. So at turns 14 and 20, uh, the barriers have been pushed back from the side of the tracks, uh, giving some extra runoff area uh, if needed. Uh, this massively helps with visibility around the corner, going, what, 180 mile an hour around, the, around them two bends. And it just gives more visibility and more time to then react to, say, a slow car and go around the corner and then gives them the opportunity for the um the the pass on the uh, runoff if they do need it uh turns eight and ten have also been pushed back slightly and these small changes will definitely help um four five and six they haven't done anything um but the the risk is there and that's what makes it such an exciting circuit um it it would kind of get rid of this risk which probably the drivers would say is too much um but it it's a great circuit yes in the last couple of years there have been small little problems with it but it can can go both ways being such a great race and then raining mobile safety cars that kind of thing we've also had some beveled curbs uh, I think this is to basically just to keep people on track uh, uh, on the, the apexes at turns 4, 8, 10, 11, 17 and turn 23. I think th this will generally not for safety but just for um, track limits basically. We've also had some um, rumble strips uh, at 3, 14, 19, 20 and 21 and again... Uh, th this is kind of just to keep people on track and possibly safety um, to learn the track itself and not where the track limits are and hopefully keep people out of the walls. So what are your thoughts and are you excited for the 2023 Jeddah uh, Grand Prix?